and welcome once again to Telford ELM Kids Extravaganza. My name is Felicia. Thank you so much for joining. Today's theme is about taking right and wise advices. Stay with us to learn more about it. Before we move on, let us pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for this wonderful day we have gathered in your name as we are about to worship and watch the Bible story. Open up our hearts and minds. In Jesus' precious name I pray. Amen. Love so incredible.
these memory verse is in Proverbs 19 verse 20. Listen to advice and accept instruction that you may gain wisdom in the future. Proverbs 19 verse 20. It's a lie. See the wonderful stories inside. Every day I'm searching me through history and poetry. How much Jesus loves me. God's great story lives. There's no other book like this. This book is alive. First Kings. After King Solomon died, his son Rehoboam became king. Yay! I'm the king now. The people sent a leader to the new king to speak up for them. So, how's everything going? Not so good. Listen, we've worked hard for your father. He made us pay lots of taxes and forced us to work building his palaces. Please give us some rest and we'll be willing to serve you. Hmm, I'll tell you what. Give me three days to think it over, then come back. King Rehoboam decided to talk it over with the same men who gave his father King Solomon, wise advice. So what should I do? How do you think I should answer the people? If you will be a servant to the people, have compassion, and work things out with them, they'll end up doing anything for you. Yes, Your Majesty. That would be the wise thing to do. Hey, I'm not sure you guys are right. After all, you guys are old. What do you guys think? Should I lighten up on the people? Now tell me what you really think. After all, we have grown up together. Uh, forget about what those old geezers told you. Yeah, the people are just being a bunch of whiners. Hey, I know what you should tell them. Tell them my little finger is thicker than my father's waist. If you think my dad worked you hard, you haven't seen the half of it. Yeah, and then you should say, my dad hit you with whips, but I'll beat you up with chains. That'll show them who's king. You guys are right. Those old guys don't even know what they're talking about. Three days later, Jeroboam and the people showed up to hear what King Rehoboam had to say. Hey, if you think my dad worked you hard, you haven't seen half of it. My dad hit you with whips, but I'll beat you up with chains. What do you think about that? Get lost, King Rehoboam. We've had it with you. Go ahead, go. What do I care? Because King Rehoboam didn't listen to the wise advice of his leaders, the kingdom of Israel was split in half. Instead of ruling over all of Israel, as his father Solomon did, King Rehoboam only ruled over the towns of Judah. The rest of the tribes went with Jeroboam, and he ruled over them. In this Bible story, we saw Rehoboam did not listen to the advices of the elders. And so it led to division in Israel and people hated him. Similarly, when we take wrong advices, it brings wrong image in our life. It separates us from our loved ones. If someone gives you an advice, Think for a moment, will God be pleased by this act? Is there love? Is there humility in this? If you think about it, God will lead you. You can get right advices from your parents, from your teachers. They will take you in the right path. Right advices will always bring humility, love and respect. Today we are going to make a headband relating to our theme, listening to right advices. First, you can draw the shape of a pair of ears. Say like this, you can draw a shape of a pair of a ear, outline of it. Uh, you have drawn the outline, cut out the shape of the ear. After you cut out the outline of the ear, you will have, have a pair of an ear. Okay. Now cut 
two strips of a thick colored paper say like this one and two yeah two strips of paper after you have cut just glue both the ends of the strip two strip of paper just only the edges of both the ends just glue them then on the front of the strip of paper write listening to right advices listening to right advices then glue the pair which you have cut on either side of the strip where you have written listening to right advices same similar like this and this is how your headband will look like hope you enjoyed the craft today dear heavenly father we thank you lord as we learn from today's bible story help us lord to take right and wise advices keep us away from all the wrong advices guide us and guard us commit all those who are watching and their loved ones into your mighty hand in jesus precious name i pray amen thank you for joining hope you enjoy today's session as we have begun this new year may god lead us to take the right decisions in our life have a wonderful week take care god bless see you all soon bye